that have been created by the community. Um, it's really unique in that the immersive experiences created on Roblox can be played just about anywhere. So top Roblox games like Work at a Pizza Place or Roblox's top model can be played on a PC, on a Mac, on an iOS phone or tablet, or on an Android phone or tablet. And we're really excited that we've kind of announced we're coming to, to Xbox as well. So these super popular experiences and games are going to be able to play on the Xbox along with all these other platforms. And that's Xbox One, is it, rather than the That's right. Moving to console, why did you just choose Xbox One? Or is that just the first place you'll be and you'll go to other places? Or is there some sort of exclusivity? There, we've had a long and good relationship with Microsoft. Right now, Windows um, on PCs is still the most popular place where Roblox is played. And we also do a lot of work with Microsoft Technologies. So we, we, we kind of have a little partnership with Microsoft where we're coming to Xbox One and we're launching initially with 15 like super curated titles that we think are super special and good for the Xbox. But ultimately, this is going to be another way of accessing the Roblox platform. And developers on Roblox are going to be able to immediately play the games they create on the Xbox One. So what springs to mind is Disney Infinity, because obviously you can create on the iPad and also create on consoles as well and have that same sort of cross-platform that you're talking about. What, what makes Roblox stand out? Yeah, so, so a couple things to look at would be like Disney Infinity's Toy Box and also Microsoft's got a project called Spark Project Yeah, we've, also we've, available. Yeah, we've looked at that a lot. Uh, on the Xbox. I, I think the, the one place to, to really start is um, just the depth of creation that's, that's really popular and can be done on Roblox. Roblox, every single thing in Roblox, not just um, the high level games, but all the assets. Everything on Roblox has been created by the community. So the, the cars have been put together in Roblox, the trucks, the buildings, the monsters, all of the game assets themselves are created and made on Roblox just the raw size of the community on Roblox. At peak times, we have almost a quarter million people right now playing 100% user-generated content. And all of the content on Roblox has been created by the community. You know, it's not kind of a hybrid as part of maybe a, a more, you know, more core product like Disney Infinity. We're 100% kind of committed to the UGC angle. If you search our catalog and you want to find it, you know, maybe a, a military simulator about the Civil War, you'll find those kind of experiences. Or if you're trying to find a game where you get to take care of a pony, you'll find that the community has created that. So that the depth of, of what's been made kind of goes hand in hand with this, this number of creations that are happening. Sounds great. And so um, on the Xbox One, is there a game that you purchase? Is, is there a one-off cost? And how does that no, compare to previous it, So one really cool thing about Roblox, and we've seen other people kind of follow, is it's 100% premium. And the, the reason it can be 100% premium is the creators themselves on Roblox are ultimately the people who would power any monetization. So you have really interesting kind of games on Roblox where, um, take Bird Simulator for instance. It's an actual game where you get to pretend you're a bird. And nice. <laughs> fly. Yeah, it's really cool. And the monetization model is more like if you want to be an eagle, that's where you might have to use some virtual currency to you know, get to be the eagle sooner than if you kind of played your way there. And that's all been figured out by the developer themselves. So um, that allows Roblox to be completely free on all platforms. And so, um, so how do you make money? I mean, obviously, as it's mentioned freemium, but there's in-app in -app style purchases, are there? Top developers on Roblox make 3D immersive experiences. Um, people come to play them. A small portion of the people, or in sometimes a large portion, get interested enough in the game or experience that they want to spend some money. And then they can use our virtual currency Robux to you know, buy power-ups, in this case become an eagle in the bird simulator, possibly get a VIP badge or unlock a door or something. 
it comes full circle because the developers on Roblox then can actually, um, at certain points, kind of cash out some of the virtual currency they've earned and use it to, you know, fund college. Some of some of our developers earn over twenty thousand dollars a month. If a parent was looking to to get their child into game creation and they're looking at what's available, so they're looking at Disney Infinity, Little Big Planet, even Super Mario Maker and Roblox and Project Spark. What is it in a you know in maybe just a few words that you think this is why you should choose Roblox? I think Roblox covers the full range in a smooth kind of progression, all the way from putting a few assets together in a mashup and immediately playing it on any platform, which is very satisfying, all the way up to starting to write some code to power some of the digital assets you create all the way to writing, you know, really sophisticated multiplayer experience